two dreadful years have passed. Hi to everyone watching. Time to end the radio silence. We've been hard at work developing our next project, Kingdom Come Deliverance, the board game. And we can't wait you to show you the results. Yeah, because uh, last year uh, at Essen Spiel, when we uh, for the first time presented the game uh, to, to the to players, to the audience, uh, we just knew there's a lot of uh, work ahead of us. And we came up with uh, really cool ideas uh, uh, that we just thought it would be a shame to, to omit them. So we didn't. And now uh, we think the, the work paid off and it's ready to be shown to you. Yeah, we will present you the individual game elements and, and components in the following series of updates. And we will talk about what uh, makes the game unique and why we are sure you will enjoy playing it. Uh, for now, we will bring you a little sneak peek. Kingdom Come is a cooperative game for one to four players. You will get to visit Bohemia in the 15th century uh, during Hussite Wars. The game brings a responsive and quite immersive world. Our main goal was uh, just to uh, provide a truly cinematic experience uh, uh, to players. Actually, we would like to push the, uh, ex uh, what is generally expected from uh, a term board game. And to, uh, to achieve this, uh, the, first, the very first step for us uh, was just to uh, create and develop a living world, the mechanics for a living world that reflects uh, what the player does and their actions. Yeah, another significant part of the, uh, of the experience is the sound design. Not only are the characters uh, voiced by professional uh, actors, but the sound design and music adapt uh, and evolve according uh, to what is currently happening in the game. And, uh, not just sounds, but also the uh, NPCs are responsive to, uh, to your behavior in the game. Uh, for example, they uh, react uh, to how suspicious your, uh, your actions uh, seem to them. And uh, to make gameplay as smooth as possible, we just tied, uh, tied the game uh, to an app and to an app that handles the, the, and takes care of all the rules and mechanics. But uh, don't worry, we, uh, we make sure you're spending time uh, playing the game with your fellow, uh, fellow players, fellow friends, uh, rather than, uh, than looking to your phone. You will get to travel uh, back in time uh, to the medieval times and trust us, when we say those were some dark times indeed, you will be on a secret mission and your success or failure could change the course of the history. Each campaign consists uh, of um, approximately five adventures and each will change uh, your character beyond the recognition. How? That's up to you. Uh, similar to, uh, to the original digital game, we created a, a mechanics how to build up your character that's, that's mainly based on, uh, on the actions your uh, character uh, uh, does. So uh, if you're frequently uh, fighting or attending combat, you could expect that your character is gonna be a really good fighter. Yeah, the game is currently uh, undergoing uh, testing, intensive testing, and we can't wait to show you uh, the game in detail. Throughout uh, the testing process, we knew that a lot of game elements are yet to be finalized. Even so, the experience uh, was alive from the beginning and exploring the uh, world was fun from the, from the start. I love the original game and uh, I, I'm glad that the team managed to transfer uh, some of its elements into the board game. For example, the character developing system. There's a lot to explore. Strong storyline, uh, thick atmosphere. Uh, there's a lot of quests and a bunch of dice, yet the game still remains compact and easy to get into. And I'm really looking forward to test the final version. Uh, in the coming weeks, uh, we're going to give you a detailed uh, run-through of all the game components, mechanics and features and all the stuff. We will also uh, let you have a peek at the storyline and uh, show you uh, what kind of world your experience and situation. Uh, we collaborated uh, with Andrzej from Warhors, uh, one of the story designers uh, of the video game. When the guys from Boardcubator showed us the first prototype, it was instantly clear that they're making their life hard. Uh, just as we did when we were making the video game. We really liked the concept, 
And personally for me, it was great to help with something like that. We always wanted to make a board game about Kingdom Come, but Portcubator really surprised us with what it can actually be. So I think it, this will be um, a huge step for the whole genre and it will blur some lines between board games and video games. Okay, so we hope we managed to grab your attention and see you at the next update. And uh, if you want to make sure you're not missing anything from us, just follow the uh, KCD GameFout project uh, link below. So, uh, see you soon. And trust me, this game is going to be so alive, you will end up needing more chairs at the table. <laughs>